Hello, welcome. My name is Cameron Stewart. I'm the Senior Technical Marketing Manager here at SolarEdge. And today we're gonna to look at small rooftop commercial using our SolarEdge design tool. The last and one of the most important steps is you are able to export this to the monitoring portal. So why is this important? You know, SolarEdge offers you module level data, right? Or I guess in the commercial case, it's module pair data. So we can see what the modules are doing. Do you have potential induced degradation? Do you have a blown diode? We can identify those things on the monitoring portal, the know before you go. And we strongly encourage you, no matter what, to always activate the, the monitoring and map your system. So if we export this to the monitoring portal, uh, it's gonna uh, recognize our project name, Stuart1923. Uh, you can duplicate these designs if you want to change the design or what have you. You can duplicate those designs uh, and then we can define the installation date. Oh, maybe this is actually gonna go in uh, in uh, the end of Q1. So maybe we say March, 2023. So we'll export this to the monitoring portal. And now that I've done this, I remembered that uh, when you're in the monitoring portal, once those designs are exported, they're permanent. <laughs> you can't delete those, uh, those sites out of the monitoring portal. So don't just randomly export designs because then your uh, monitoring portal is gonna look uh, not that great. So I'm gonna click okay. The export was successful. And let's take a look at what it looks like when it's in the portal. The project layout, if you wanted to download this design as a PDF or a DXF, you could. So I'll just download the PDF because I don't have AutoCAD on this computer. Uh, but it, it's gonna look roughly the same. So if you wanted to import this drawing into your AutoCAD tool, uh, you could totally do that. And that's this starts you off on the right foot for your project. It is a scale drawing, so you can see uh, what the scale is up here. And you can put that into your AutoCAD to build your permit pack. But that's what it looks like. And it gives you a, a detailed plan of what the strings look like. Okay, let's take a look at the monitoring portal. So I'm going to go to the SolarEdge monitoring portal. So that's just monitoring.solaredge.com. Uh, I clicked I'm not a robot and I'm going to click log in. And we should see the Stuart design has been exported to the monitoring portal. All right, so here's the, uh, here's the design we just made. All right, so let's go ahead and click it. And the reason why this is important uh, is there's a couple of reasons. A, now when we're doing the install, the installer can go to the SolarEdge site mapper tool on their cell phone. They can log in and they can map the locations of the optimizers using the QR code for their, from their phone. So that's one way to map. The other way to map is, to, uh, is a new feature. And if we can see here we have the strings designed. And if you look right here, we can download this as a PDF, okay? So I'm gonna rotate my image and I'm gonna say download as a PDF. Oh wait, sorry, I wanna, I wanna go to mapping. That's what I wanna do because we wanna be able to map. So if I were mapping individually, like someone handed me a sheet of stickers that's, we could drag and drop the serial numbers of the optimizers to their corresponding locations. That takes a long time. But what I can do is I can click this button that says barcode scanning and you can drop pictures into the layout editor of the QR codes and we will automatically map for you. So the best way to do that is if you go back to stringing and we're gonna click this uh, PDF button and we're going to define a paper size. So a three. So we're going to say, yep, this is this quadrant because the stickers are so big. This is this quadrant of solar panels. Okay. I'm going to save this PDF. All right. So if you look at the PDF, now you can give this to the installer and they have a spot to put each sticker. So they can put each sticker. And when you take a picture of this sitemap, 
me zoom out a little bit so you can see the four QR codes. So if you take a picture of this sitemap, you can see that the QR codes tells our tool where those serial numbers belong. And when we do that, then you can, the tool will self map with just the picture. So you don't have anything extra to do. So you just create a couple of those pages uh, for each solar panel or each group of solar panels. And again, define the page that you're printing on. So it could be 11 by 17, it could be arc E or arc D or whatever it might be. And you can, uh, from a photograph, have the whole site self map. All right, so that's why exporting the design to the monitoring portal is important and why I always recommend you do it. Thank you very much for your time and attention. This was Small Rooftop Commercial. Again, my name is Cameron Stewart. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to SolarEdge. We are always happy to help you. I hope you have a great day.